Good day, Lords and Ladies. Welcome back to the last spell. We made it day three. In the previous uh, fight, went down without too much issue. Held the wall nicely here. There are some good rewards here if you want to harvest them. Really nice rewards. Um, but we should decide if we want to build some stuff. We probably we do need to be honest, build some stuff. Because um, not as not, not, not nice as having money is, we do need to have ways of, for example, restoring mana. Because you're just short. You're just short. All heroes, okay. Have that going. Having just passive gold products would be nice as well. Um, basic healing. Defensive item. That's more like, the sooner we get that down, the more that pays off in the long run. Um... Okay. Let's put one in here. Yeah. So if you want to do we can get an item from here for free, which is always nice. And we get one free every round. Um, we don't get it when you build it, though. It's unfortunate. Right. That's going to be 20 gold, 36 tainted essence, so we can get all that for 40. I'm going to go for the item. There's no two level buildings can be destroyed. So we either get the money, materials, and get an item. Or we can just straight up get a defensive item for free here. That takes two. Now let's, let's get that. And the final person who will spend... Yeah. Four gold would make us 41 gold in total. We can get 59 gold. An extra 38 production materials. Would be nice, especially since we have such a large edge here to fortify, yeah. Let's get the we can construct some materials. Okay. Let's see what we get from the part of the corpses. Pistol. Ooh, experience gain is nice. Wooden short bow. I'm probably going to get to grab the pistol for him. I know it seems strange, but I just want that experience gain and critical hit. Plus, it sells for more money, to be honest. Okay, magical orb, loose health. Restored. Or we can get a gun early on, that would be nice. Let's see. Rifle, long shot, hip shot. It's massively inaccurate the further away it is. Okay. 
That's unblockable. Undodgeable. Inaccurate. Hip shots. You suit from the hip. The difference between this one. Three to twelve targets. Okay. And it's undodgeable. Oh, it's two action. Oh, it's two action economy. Ooh. Okay. And that has times two inaccuracy. Or we can get resistance dodge, resistance momentum. How are you looking on movement? So here, I'll drop you down to six. If you do that, hex away accuracy and resistance and stuff for you. And your range is pretty good, but I want you soon the bow, really, rather than with the musket. I mean, the musket is so much more damage, but it's limited in range. And you only have, and it takes two shots. Okay, but the damage thing is high. Inaccurate. Suppressing fire. Assassinate. Um, against my better judgment, I've got to grab the musket. He has the range to make it so it's not so much of a problem. But six isn't great. But if push comes to sub, he can just sort out for the musket and we can do assassinations. Experience game on him though would have been nice. Just to get him have experience increase. Alas, okay. Can't be helped. Give it to the wizard. They have chain ability, which is nice in comparison to this. And the only benefit of giving it to the wizard is because we're only really using it for these two abilities. I mean, not bad, but it is range damage. Critical power, resistance, accuracy. Ah. I just have to hold on to it for now. Okay. Off-handed hammer. This bash, okay. Sword, one-handed. Silver short bow. Right. Let's not think about armors for a second. Um, well, let's not think about weapons for a second. Let's think about other things. Such as accessories. Range damage. Not bad. Yeah, increase range damage for him. Not bad. Another mana potion would be useful. Grape shot. Yeah. Okay. Block. Dodge. Mana. Dex. Action point. Energy. And 
improved crossbow, maybe. What's the twin that one he's got? Okay. A bit more damage. Um, a bit more critical hit chance. By the looks of it, not really worth the money. Really wish I. Wasn't there anything that allowed us to reroll? Oh, we can reroll. But it takes 10 gold. Jeez. Uh, dodge. Probably want to grab, to be honest, is grab the mana potion. It's probably our best bet. That's just more poison, though. More poison that propagates if we're going to the, go into the poison build. Sell the pistol. It's a nice pistol. Does, yeah, it does less damage. Okay, I know what I'm going to do. Why can't I sell anything? Yeah, I got... Oh, I broke down too far. Okay. 47. Um, we'll grab... This... Oh, we get straight up more post mana potions. We can't get that anyway. Mm. Actually, we can. Because if he's getting. Because if he's getting his shield switched out. Getting his shield switched out, we can give him the improved shield. Yeah. It's not great. I'd like to give him both on both hands. But I'd rather just get a straight up improved version and the crossbow. Level 2 mana potion is nice. Ah. No. Let's think. Let's be reasonable about this. Drop that down. Sell that. That is a nice bow. Oh, so good. Stay on target. Hindsight now, I could have... Ugh, hindsight is fantastic. Because I could have just realised... <laughs> yeah, I can buy it back. That's fine. The single... The, the basic hand crossbow is not worth my time. Yeah, there you go. Block goes up, which is nice. Can't stock a ton of damage, but he's got a good enough amount of armor. Um, and his base stuff goes up, which is good. Because I, I really picked it up more for the poison damage, for the propagation ability of his. Hit them with contagion, hit them with poison, and we just go to town. Okay. I mean, we've got enough money that if we wanted to, we could get more essence, which is basically the weapon producer. The only thing we could buy is unlocking some of the more base weapons. 
There's no potions. Omens. A lot of omens. Um, the thing is, having the shops really important. Okay. Next is production. So they're coming in here. One group's coming in here. Main group is coming in here. So we need to get... to get walls up realistically. Didn't need to put it here because they can just fly across that. That was my my mistake. Can't reclaim that. Can I? No. Just don't get resources back. Okay. Go for a gate. I am tempted to put another um, catapult down, to be honest. Just to help whoever's stationed here. I mean, having them up here would be nice as well, because it would deal with flyers and stuff. The main attack is coming this way. We lose a lot of vision if we put it up there, we would also... But the flyers can get over here anyway, so it doesn't really matter. But this is a good person to have. Put one of these down. They can cover this approach and pick off enemies that are trying to get around here, including stuff like flyers. Okay. A little bit of money left. We can throw another barricade if we want. Yeah, no barricade. The thing is, the enemy is just going to be charging straight for this gate, which I'm not a massive fan of. Um, put one here just to slow them down from getting into the settlement. I would like it if these things actually turned around and fired. That would be really cool. Um, but yeah, not going to be great early on. Because obviously they're going to be mostly spawning in this side. But taking out stragglers, flyers, that kind of thing would be nice. Um, let's think of the deployment phase. Okay. This and the heroes. Sticking him up here is not so bad. He's got limited range, but he can like run from here into here and help deal with threats as they develop. Um, I'm going to stick these two down together. And you have the movement. 
The loss of contagion hurts. But there's not a ton of enemies coming in from this direction. So you can just run and gun and stun people. Um, good work. Because the main attack's going to be coming from here. So these three really need to hold the line this way. Yeah. This could work. I'm just trying to think about it. The thing is, this may be a shorter episode, folks, if that's the case. I am sorry. Um, but I don't want to basically start an, a fight and then try and do it all in one thing. So it would be going longer than I, than I want, to be honest. Um, especially on the third night. That tends to be when stuff really, really starts to get moving. Um, so we might have a much earlier episode just to tie in for when the horde is. I don't think I can exit. Yeah. I'm just thinking. Um... No, we'll go for it. Let's go. Yeah, saving. Man, they're right here. Okay. You weren't messing about, were you, mate? Shoot from the hip. And be gone with you. Um, you are being super aggressive early. defense. Crossbow can take him out. Right, let's start propagation. Manner looking on you. Okay. And they're not going anywhere for a while. He won't die from the poison, but he's still contaminated, which is fine. Right. Ouch. They're in the city limits, and panic's already gone through the roof. Okay. And it's movement points and accuracy. Won't really kill him though. Yeah, we're going to have to start sniping these guys early. 
Okay. Hurt off the bat is not a great start. Okay. Aren't you a big boy? Okay. First of all, get that going. They're going to be able to, that thing's going to be able to get into the walls. Okay. Okay, so that's going to be propagating. Well, we were just dead to be honest. On this flank, let's start off as we intend to proceed. Nice slow down all the troops. So on this flank, let's start with down here, where we're going to have some issues I can foresee. Um, for range of four, one, two, three, four. So I'd have to come here, kill them, move up. Nah, that's not going to work. Okay. Room around time it is. That's better. Um Hit you twice. You're limited how far you can move as well.
Should have just shot you in my mana. This panic is increasing. Okay. Contagious. So those guys aren't moving. Is he reaching the wall this turn? No. But I'm worried about him nonetheless. Okay. Want him out of the way, really. Right. Down on this side of things. He would die from the poison. Anyone making mischief? Okay, then you can go back to your position. Okay. Slow those guys down, they're still going to be a pain, okay. Okay, that's going to be contagious to you guys. on you, stuns you a lot, which is fine. You guys are stuck and out of the way for a moment, that's good. Snipe him. Okay. Get with contagion. You'll just be alive from the poison, which is fantastic because I have a plan. The rest we can dump into basically this big oaf. One second, folks, be right back. And we're back. Okay. Here. Let's 
That's going to leave me exposed, but... I now have ways of dealing with enemies. I mean, if they get too close, I can just stab them. him done. None of them are going to be getting to the walls this turn, so let's... That's a lot. Okay. No more flyers, though. Let's start the contagion spreading. Man, they're still gonna be moving, are they? Okay. End of the hero's turn, apply 35 damage to all enemies within a range of 3. I mean, it's not the worst thing in the world, I suppose. I mean... Let's get the chopping. Now oh, you can actually reach me. Good for you. Okay. Down this side. I really don't want to use any more. Yeah, poison would do for you. You're dead. You're not moving, you're going to be moving this turn. So the ones that are going to be continually moving are... I'm just going to take you two out now. Because the rest can't easily get about now. Twenty-eight people left. Okay, we can do this quickly. Um, get the chopping. I 
That's not good. End of the hero's turn. Now the way. Um. I'm just going to put his dodge up. Right, you're a pain. You're stuck now. Got the achievement social distancing. I'm just going to die from the damage that I wanted to basically take now. Yeah, because I got to take a ton of damage, so I want it to spread. No poison, he's not getting in. Bit of a security panic now. We got that guy there. Take out the dagger. Touch bit of health damage. That's fine. Make doubly so you're dead, Sunny Jim. Oh, I forgot he didn't have contagion on him. Contagion is a nasty combo. There we go.
Lost a little bit of health. Fantastic. And uh, lots of lovely loot as well. That's the next time, folks. I've been Connor Snipe. This has been the last spell, and I've been a bit over, gone a bit further than I wanted, but we'll see you all again next time. Goodbye, folks. <laughs>